Made it to Wyoming. Look at the snow. Look what Abby found. Okay, this is a roadside attraction that we had to stop at. We're gonna be uh, showing you a little bit closer, but it's warm in here. So this is a little plaque. So it's 13, the sculpture is 13 and a half feet tall. The pedestal is 35 feet tall. And it's 48 and a half feet tall total. Very cool. It's very cute. And it says that it took 11 months to make. So, well, probably together. Yeah, completed in only 11 months. So that's pretty cool. Commissioned 1959. I need to go out and stand by it. They used the, the local rock to, uh, to form the base. The sculpture alone weighs 4,500 pounds. Cast in 30 pieces bolted together. That's pretty cool. Very neat. So this is the, um, the Lincoln Highway out here. So this is 80, Interstate right? Interstate 80 is what we're on. We yeah. just came from that way. And uh, so this is the highest point on the Lincoln Highway. So you can see the little L that they used to mark, mark it before, thanks to the Boy Scouts. Nice. It's pretty cool. This is a cool rest area. They have uh, a lot of information in here for the state of Wyoming, talking about the national parks. So what was the other fun fact that you just read? We already knew about Yellowstone. Oh, okay, so Yellowstone was the first national park and Devil's Tower was the first national monument. So Wyoming got both of the first. That's awesome. And uh, did I say Devil's Tower? Yeah. Yeah, I, Devil's Tower. We loved that place. So put that on your list if you haven't yeah. been. It was Great place. Totally, We've totally got a video cool. of that if you have not uh, yeah. seen that. Yeah. It's such a wonderful, cool place to go. And uh, we just passed by an area that I really want to come back to. So yep. we put it on our list. So you want to go brave the cold? And yeah, let's go out there and check out the monument. This yeah. has been a cool little rest area here. Can we go out right here? All right. So this is our first bit of snow that we've gotten into on this yes, trip. Yes, it is. We uh, kind of are narrowly escaping the, the worst of it. Yeah. But it's been really, really pretty up here. So uh, it's about 38 degrees out here right now. So. Hard packed snow. There's the Kodiak up there. This is just cool. I got to put on my shades. The snow is bright. <laughs> Are you excited? You know, this is always fun for me. Mm -hmm. Everybody else is over it right now, but it's it makes for a pretty drive. Yes, it does. That is just too cool. That is cool. The, uh, the inside was hollow, but there were some lightning rods in there. Makes okay. sense. I love these roadside attractions, don't you? We must think anew and act anew. Abraham Lincoln. Very cool. Very cool. Very quick little roadside attraction here that you can stop at if you're uh, taking I-80 through Wyoming. Woo, that wind. Yeah, it's a little breezy. Yes. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna head down a road a little ways. So, <laughs> Laramie is the next major city that we're gonna hit. Uh, we're gonna stop, and get us some lunch, top off the Ram with some fuel, and then uh, our destination for today is going to be Little America, which Abby's really Yay! excited about. It's another roadside attraction all in itself, yes. but it's just a stopover for us because they actually have an RV park there. Yes, but it's like its own little town at that rest area there we've never been but i'm it's gonna need a t-shirt supposed to been there mug, maybe a, it's, it's been there for like 75 years yeah. or more but they have like a restaurant there i and... have a friend at home <laughs> she has a mug that she got there 50 years ago that's pretty cool if they have one like that i'm gonna get one for her and i'm gonna get one for me yep i'm excited that'll be fun so yeah. we're looking forward to that 
And uh, yeah, that's it. It's this... cold. <laughs> All right, well, let's go get back in the truck because it is cold with this wind blowing out here. But we wanted to share this fun little stop and yes. just make a quick little video. It's things like this that you have to do to your trip search for some of your roadside attractions. You stop for a few minutes, you get a little break, walk around. And, Go to uh, the bathroom, take that a was a nice bathroom in there. Yeah, it's a really like nice that. place. Yeah. All right, so I next know, stop, Little America. I was gonna say, I know they probably really can't see the view on the with the GoPro. No. But it is just gorgeous right here. <laughs> it really is. I mean, You it's can kind of just... still see the fog that we went through way in the distance there, There's but it's kind of pushed through. There's mountains in the through. background, there's snow everywhere. Oh, it's yeah. just absolutely beautiful it really is really is pretty out here with the snow thanks for stopping at this one babe absolutely i love this <laughs> i did too snow's a little <laughs> deep right here off the trail look at this <laughs> wyoming Be careful yep Look how cute our Kodiak looks with all the snow. <laughs> <laughs> it's cute. Feels right at home. <laughs> Kodiak has been doing great on this trip. It's been pulling nicely. Yes. I think I have everything dialed in good. I think everything works better with our new battery too. I just gotta say. It has been working well. Yeah. It's cold. Ooh. Let's get back in that truck My where it's warm. Icicles. Cool rest area here. A lot of picnic tables. A lot of recreation in this immediate area as well. Okay, we're out of here. Chester's chicken is closed, but there's a Papa John's right next door. You get a Papa John's pizza and you enjoy it in the car. That's what you do. Yeah, you just go with the flow and take what life gives you. Yep. It's been a great ride for a slice of pizza, though. Look how pretty it is out here. It's gorgeous. Wyoming. I love it. Definitely looks like some snow over there. Oh, for sure. That's pretty. Yeah, it is. The winds in Wyoming here have been terrible. Yes. And our awning, our slide out top, actually started ripping off. It started separating from the top rail there. It is snowing. You can see it in the video. Yeah. It is freezing. <laughs> it's cold. It's, it's about to start snowing. Yes. I, we just took zip ties and tried to zip tie in several places just to try to hold it there. My plan is when we get to our next stop, it's an hour and a half down the road, I'm just going to cut that thing off there. Yep. I'm just going to try to get it off. I've yep. only got my short ladder, so I can just barely get to it. But we'll have to take this thing completely off and throw it away. Yep. That's been a it's been a problem ever since we put it on yeah, there. It has so been. I guess it's just gotta come off. Yep. But we've had really, really bad winds today. Yes. And I think that's what the culprit is. We can't see your hair flapping in the wind, but you it's can see mine. Cold and windy. Yes so it is. It's in the road. Okay. We got here just in time. Yes, we it's did. It's been snowing about the last 15 <laughs> miles. So this is Little America. Little America. We got to go check in. We got an RV park right there. That's where we're staying tonight. <laughs> We 
made it to Little America just in time for the snow. <laughs> but we managed to get the slide uh, topper off there. You yep. see it's laying right here. What a piece of junk that is. Yeah, it ripped completely off from there. Yeah. So I think it was a combination of being a just a junk part and uh, the winds. Yeah. Between those two, it just yeah. ripped it right on off that rail up there. Well, it happens. So I left the brackets up there. No need, no need to take those off. No. So anyway. That's okay. I ain't going to worry about it. No. We're gonna, we'll, we'll, we'll deal with that another time. But the rest of this trip, we're not going to have a slide topper up That's here. That's okay. It's yeah. okay. Oh, it'll, it'll be fine without yeah. it. It just helps keep the weather off the top of it. Yeah. Is what it does. But we'll be fine. Now we can get set up. Our first uh, snow setup, I think. Yeah. For this trip. Yeah.